Einstein didn't just unravel the workings of time. He brought us much closer to an understanding of the whole of the universe. Einstein founded modern cosmology. Relativity led to an astonishing conclusion. The size of the universe changes with time. The old idea of an unchanging and infinite universe was replaced by a dynamic expanding universe with a beginning and an end. In 1929, the American astronomer Edwin Hubble found the evidence. Not only was the universe expanding, but the further away a galaxy was, the greater the speed at which it was moving away. However, Einstein was convinced that the universe was static. He modified his theory, introducing a factor called the cosmological constant into his equations something which he later called the greatest mistake of his life. Lots of the inhabitants of Relative City have decided to head for the centre. As they continue their orderly approach, time passes more slowly. A kiss or a hug can last a thousand years. Outside, time keeps passing and the seasons keep changing. Einstein predicted something surprising in the universe. The existence of objects with an enormous mass, concentrated in a minuscule region of space, which infinitely curves space-time so strongly that nothing, including light, can escape their gravitational pull. These are black holes. A black hole's gravitational field is so strong that inside it, time stops. For the Earth to become a black hole, it would need to be compressed into a sphere with a radius of less than one and a half centimetres. Although such an extreme configuration of material seems impossible, black holes do exist. There's one at the centre of our Milky Way. The image of the universe, according to general relativity, coincides with what has been observed up to now. However, the theory does not apply when reality becomes infinitely small. This is the terrain of what is known as quantum mechanics, a way of seeing the world in which everything is unpredictable. Something with which Einstein has never agreed. He was convinced that there existed global rules governing stars, planets, and even atoms. Everything was predictable. Einstein spent his final years creating a unified theory that would apply to the whole of the universe. Unfortunately, Einstein died on the 18th of April 1955, an icon of the 20th century, but without a unifying equation his unifying theory of everything. Murió Einstein, a quien se debe la teoría de la relatividad y otros descubrimientos científicos. If Einstein came back today, he would get a big surprise. Large numbers of scientists are engaged in experiments to accurately measure the predictions of relativity. The cosmological constant, long rejected, has reappeared as a means of explaining the acceleration of the universe. And new unifying theories like quantum gravity and string theory have appeared. The sun is going down in Relative City. The hours have passed by and the day is already over. For us, however, only an instant has passed. It all depends on your point of view. This is the great legacy of Einstein's theory of relativity. Although we live by the rigor of the clock and artificial measurements, the universe is not subject to any kind of absolute. This is its simplicity and its beauty. Einstein showed us a singular truth of the universe, that we are predestined to understand it. There's no time to lose.